Welcome back to Herder Nerd and today's episode of the Newcastle Director of Football Challenge. We're back for the FA Cup fourth round away to Sunderland. Big game. The old Newcastle Sunderland rivalry. Oh, that's a thing. So, yeah, nice little FA Cup fourth round, actually. Away to Sunderland. Got a rivalry game. Um, the easy January didn't go as well as we would have liked. Um, so, you, we, we beat Colchester. We then lost to West Ham. They scored from a free kick. Uh, we could not get back into it. Couldn't score a goal. We then drew with Norwich. We got back into They actually did play better than us. We got a draw. That was nice. We lost to Reading, who were in the relegation zone. Uh, they had a penalty and scored late on. Uh, we had Ronan Darcy sent off. So that was really good. Uh, yep, yeah, lost two on there. And then just drew 0-0 with Leicester. They were also in the relegation zone. Things going very well. We, uh, we've got something today. We're not scoring goals. I need to try and fix that. We're dominating games. Most of those games we drew, we had 20 odd shots, at least double digit shots on target, no goals. When you look at the heat map, I've got work the ball into the box on. I thought maybe that's causing the problem. No, we're shooting. Nice spray all around inside the box and just on the, on the outside. But, uh, why are they not going in? For some reason, none of the fucking shots are going in. So that's what we need to try and work on. Uh, we've got Sunderland today. We've got the transfer window about to finish. And we bought some players. So, um, yeah, we've bought three players. One, Reme Fruer, this guy. He was bought on a free contract. And I thought just bring him in. So I paid the two million to bring him in. Just a central midfielder. Pretty good, but like averagely good. We bought in we bought in Declan Rice. 36 million pounds. So Liverpool paid 55 million for him from West Ham. We've bought him for 36. Obviously, this didn't play him. It, he's a bit like defensive for our liking but can play in the the middle libero role or if you want to as a ball playing defender can play as a dlp in the middle as well prefers defend but we can put him on support and can play in the box to box role um so i mean it's Declan rice it's, as a west ham fan brilliant 25 year old Declan rice brought into to newcastle loving life uh we've also brought in a young player carl king uh probably got some good potential but we're never gonna see that Happen. On the outs, Jolinton has gone out on loan. He did wasn't sold in the end, and another youngster has gone out. Um, but apart from that, that's the that's pretty much the business. I don't think we'll do much more. We've got we still got 25 million. So he's got some money to spend. Whether he goes for a striker or not, I don't know. Uh, with Jolinton going out, Steele is injured and hasn't scored in a long time. So for this game, we're gonna mix it up. We're gonna have um Rabi up top. I'm gonna switch the center forward role to an attack rather than a support. See if we actually get I mean, we're having the shots. We're ha I just don't know why they're not going in. Um, so we just need to find the goals from somewhere. Rice is cup tied, so you won't get to see him play today. But he has been playing in the DLP position. I've been rotating Darcy Shackleton and Rice in that middle piece. We've got uh, I am going to move into the libero. See if he gets more work than Comet does in that libero role. Because I think, again, that could be a pivotal role for us if we decide to move it forward. We've said that a lot, haven't we? In fact, I'm going to put the libero on attack. We put him on attack before, didn't we? And we didn't see much from it. Let's try adding just a little bit more attack into this. I think defensively we seem fine. Um, but we're just not getting enough goals. So let's try a few little tweaks. Having him come a little bit further forward and support these guys here. Which may give Shackleton a bit more of a, a role to run forward. And Rabi on attack, who will be still on attack rather than support. As we go in against Sunderland. Stadium of Light, FA Cup, fourth round. This is what matters. Getting ourselves that damn trophy. So, who have they got? They've not really got anyone. Where are even Sunderland these days? League One. They're bloody in League One. Right. So are Colchester. God, we've got to beat these guys. We've had an easy run so far. Okay. Passionate. Expect fans. Yes, they love it for the fans. Remember, we do have rivals. They're just really bad. <laughs> and the game is underway. We get to play in our black and white stripes. Against the Scummers. Amavi, great play. We've nearly got Mike Mikalenko back on the left-hand side. Amavi has been playing. Rahman been scrolling. Actually, those wide plays are the ones that are struggling the most for us in this formation currently. They are the ones I am the most, uh, I'm subbing the most. Rabi going back up top. He played up top of four. You remember the first game of the season when I thought I was going to win everything and he scored five. So let's see if we can get something out of him. Still enjoying, I mean, he's scored, he scored within three minutes. Go on, Simeon Baba. Rabi gets the goal. One nil up. Jordan Amavi just picked him up. Gets the cross to, to get the goal. And uh, we go one nil up within three minutes. Maybe putting the centre forward on attack gives us an actual linchpin to aim for and helps get the goals. Or we're playing a League One opposition and we should beat them anyway. 
What have we got here? Valerie with the throw in. Rabi. Oh, ball comes out. With Lenses here. This is what we can watch out for. Aya steps up. Lovely job. Plays it forward to no one. Valencia. Valencia just striding through. Clark. A little bit too much control here. Sunderland. Onin. Back to power. Inside to Reed. Saki. Are they going to shoot long range? They've let us get back in now, which is good for us, to be fair. I don't like how long this highlight's going on for. They're playing a lot of short passes. Darcy robs it. Neto away. Rabi pushing forward. Shax is up as well. Four forward. Shackleton. Oh, Jamie, boy. That was lovely. That was a lovely attack. We got the ball. We countered. And we actually used our attacking threat there. We look like a dangerous side. Of course, I will tailor this by saying, again, Sunderland are in League One. But look at this forward play here. We robbed the ball and we've got four men in their box. And Shackleton, that was a great play, but... Four men forward. Good attacking play. You love to see it. Onin forward now. Sunderland, can they get back in it? Amavi misses the block. Darcy gets back. Darcy seems to be having a good game. Out to power. Long shot blocked again. Pierce tries to go over the top. Makes it. Clark shoots miles wide. I love we have two. Now we've had two bloody shots on target. And two goals. Uh, other games, 10 shots on target. It's no goals. Ramsdale. Big ball forward. Nice nod on by Valerie. Darcy back to Neto. Actually, this is working, I think, because look at look where Rabi is. Rabi, well, one is offside, but he is playing on that last man constantly. He's pushing forward rather than dropping and letting guys trying to come in behind him. He's actually leading as a as a tip of the arrow point. See if that helps. We've given the ball to Clark straight from our goal kick, which isn't great because we have five defenders to aim for there. Onin, Reed, out. Onin, power. Sunderland actually having quite a lot of the possession here. In these highlights, they're keeping the ball. Onin. Inside. Clark again. Oh, yes. We've got rid of that. We've done it well. Little, little worried. Little worried. They're having too much of the ball. Neto. Free kick. Go on. Make it three. Oh, Flores saves. Four to two minutes gone. ASM. Corner in again. Diaz. No one. Of course corners. Of course corners don't work. Okay, now we're going. Now we seem to be attacking. We've got the ball back. And we are going for it. This is three attacks in a row for Newcastle. Bad ball inside there, though. No one ready for it. Milakar coming forward. Uh, he's just diving straight through the middle of defence right now. Everyone was tracking alongside him rather than actually making any tackles. Ramsdale. ASM. <sighs> nope. ASM robs. Sunderland here. Kicks off the counter. Rabi. Speed. Ooh. Not bad. I mean, he's, he took a nice touch, put it right on the edge and just throttled it. Um, it was off time, you know. But we've got our goals. Two goals. Passionate, very happy. Back out there. A nice little win against your local rivals. Reed on the ball. Sunderland trying to play in again. Out to Onin. And that's it. Okay, free kick. We'll take that. They're offside. How is he offside? Okay, fine. Reed. Oh, Pierce, Saki. They've gone back now, haven't they? They've got a bit more into this. Long shot, Ramsdale saves. They're not really getting shots off, but they're keeping the ball. I'm just going to give my guys a little demand more. 2 0 up is good. Into the second half. Comfortable performance. The changes I made appear to be working. Again, tailored by the fact this is League One opposition. 20 minutes to go. 2-0 up. Again, we've given away the ball from our goal kick. As Valencia dances through one, dances through two, and Ramsdale punches away. Sunderland now actually getting themselves back into this. Um, we need to make sure we don't lose sight of the prize. Valencia. Oh, Shax knocks out. Flores. But no one really to sub here. No one's playing badly. I just, we're not, we're not enough. We're not doing enough. I don't like what we're doing here. Valencia again is free. Somehow, we're, it's like we're tiring. They're, and we, look, we're, we're playing like a team that's been run, like it's been a little bit ragged. A little bit ragged. Let's just slow the, let's slow the passing down. Let's get a little bit more discipline in. There's no need for us to throw this away. Um, what we will do is we'll get off the tired legs. Amavi out. Uh, and do you know what? We'll take Valerie out as well. They are doing a lot of the running for us. They've gone very attacking. They have. We have. We're staying on our positive. Babarama throws it in. Ah, <laughs> comments the eyes offside. I was going to say he's knocked it down to Aya and we've scored, but no. 
No, 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 we have not. Ayers, a mile offside. And I love it. Pre-sliding before the headers even come down. Uh, another one? We've got another corner. Same again. But this time, the goal to count. Sakai clears. Clark's there. On their very attack, and they are staying out wide. St. Clair. Back like it. Kraft comes away. We've done well there. We've got two minutes of added time. Go on, Kraft. Play it off if you need to. You've got three men around you. Look at him go. Come on, Kraft, son. Little knock off to Shaxx. Where's he going? Oh, he's giving it away. Shackleton. So Kraft just runs down the wing, takes on, keeps three men at bay, plays it inside to you, simple as you like, and you lose it. I like a little cynical foul there from Comer. We'll take that, and with 20 seconds to go, surely this is it in the bag. A game that okay, we did dominate in the end, but we let them get at us. This DM, when they have the DM in, this kind of 4-1-4-1 piece, it's very dangerous. Very dangerous. Neto's on the ball here. Surely corner goes. There we go. Full time. 2-0 against Sunderland. Oh, look at that. In the end, I mean, you'd look at it and say it was an evenish game. But we'll take that. We actually scored goals. Hopefully that gets some boost to some of our attacking players because I'd like to score more. And we triumph in the time and we're Derby. We go through. Shackleton impresses again. He does score a few goals, doesn't he? Does score a few goals. Old tracks. Uh... We'll attend a press conference later. So that means that we roll on. We roll on in the FA Cup. Like I say, it's the only thing that really matters. We'll pass through. We've got Chelsea United Tottenham, which is big. We've got a few days left of the transfer window. I don't think we're going to spend the 25 million. I can't see he's going to go out and bang another big player in. We've got Deckers in there. We'll be back for the FA Cup fifth round. Oh, actually, if we keep going through the FA Cup, you might actually not get to see Declan Rice play. But yeah, we've got Chelsea United Tottenham, Man City, and then the FA Cup. So I don't really want to show you those anyway, because I'm pretty sure we're going to get screwed. So yeah, back for the FA Cup fifth round into March as we hunt the elusive single trophy. If you have enjoyed, smash the like button, subscribe if you're new. Make sure you're ready for the next save, which will sort of series, sorry, that will start straight after this one finishes. And I'll catch you next time. Have a great day. Bye-bye.